Bills opening day almost here in just three days. Citizens Bank Park will be rocking with fans. So like they do every year, the ballpark is unveiling all kinds of great new things. Love this time of year. From Philly's gear to food, fans are going to love this. Allie, she's got the choice assignment tonight. <laughs> I told her earlier I was jealous. <laughs> Allie, what's new this year? Well, Chris, Don, you're exciting me by tossing it over. Yes, I had the story of the day live from Citizens Bank Park. And I have to say the mood of the day is certainly hopeful here. We all know how the Philadelphia Phillies ended their 2023 season, but the beauty of baseball is that when one season ends, another one begins. And I and most of them today in the team specifically saying that they are looking forward to making more history. And that really starts with the fans. And now. It's time to make more history at Citizens Bank Park. It's the voice you know all too well at the bank. Phillies announcer Dan Baker helping kick off the 2024 season. Baseball will officially be back. The fight in Phils will take to the field later this week, and the stadium is nearly ready to welcome back fans as spring cleaning is underway. Fresh mulch laid, windows wiped, floors swept, and it's all those finer details that help boost the fan experience. We listen to the fan, right? You know, Philly fans are very vocal about what they like and what they don't like. Executive chef Vani Negron unveiled the new lineup of ballpark menu items, sharing partnerships with Big Mots, Primo Hoagies, and even some of their own creations, working with Kyle Schwarber to create his Oh, and the Philly Fanatics' favorite burger. But it was very exciting to get his input on a burger that he actually likes and actually eats with the ingredients that he, he suggested. Of course, there's new swag for the season and giveaways for the fans. Opening week, we're going to start with Nemours opening day with a, a scarf for all fans. Walking around the park, you might notice some upgrades, too. Over in right field, you'll see a brand new digital wall display. So this is a new, an additional 2,000 square feet of LED, which gives us nearly 20,000 square feet of LED in the ballpark to help with our fan experience. And above Ashburn Alley in left center field, you'll find an exciting new mural designed by local artist Jose Bustamante. His work celebrates Philadelphia's culture, bold spirit, and the team's mission to build brave futures. This is like an amazing opportunity. I don't really know how to feel or express it right now. That excitement all builds up to Thursday, just three days away, as the bell is ready to be rung once again. Let's make history with the Philadelphia Phillies in 2024. How can you not smile when you hear Dan Baker's voice? Man, he gives me goosebumps every single time. Uh, we all know the weather deal for Thursday. Uh, we are watching the rain. They do have Friday on hold in case the rain gets or the, the because of the rain that this game potentially gets canceled. Uh, Chris, I was going to make kind of a joke here and say we all know the song dancing on my own well uh the phillies have said they're probably not going to use that as their good luck song this year by any means i think we need to find a new one leading into thursday's game right <laughs> hmm. i didn't i thought they may be using it again i don't know we'll have to come up with another song we'll have to wait and see yeah <laughs> let's hope we uh get to a playoff run